everyone, today we are going to discuss body memory. What is body or tissue memory and how does it affect us after trauma or chronic stress? So first off, I'll mention some studies that show the body's physiological reaction, very physical reaction, to past trauma. And as a former labor and delivery nurse, I'll use a birth example. Oftentimes, after a woman has gone through a sexual assault, she does have an elevated risk of forcep-assisted delivery. And what that means, if we really zoom in on that, is when a woman is in labor, her body has a memory that something has already gone through her birth canal that was not wanted. And therefore, even as this baby is coming through, her body snaps in and says, hey, I need to react to this super quick and I'm going to close in on whatever's coming through because nothing's allowed to come through here anymore. This is completely unconscious. This is body memory. This is tissue memory. This is the body saying, uh-uh, nothing unwanted is going to come through here anymore. And then it results in these different birthing experiences. Another form of tissue memory or body memory is after abuse or trauma or chronic stress, oftentimes people will actually breathe more shallow and their posture will close in and they'll almost freeze up and the musculature will stiffen. So that affects the respiratory muscles. It also, as well, affects the lower back muscles, the pelvic muscles, the muscles around the genitalia. So we see that the musculature after chronic stress and trauma often braces itself, closes in on itself and just waits for something terrible to happen. Almost just like locking down and waiting. And so it's essentially the body musculature is living in this hypervigilant state. So when we talk about body memory and tissue memory, it's not voluntary. It's the body is actually has learned in the past that it had to do something to protect itself. And now it's resuming those activities of protecting itself, even though, you know, objectively, there's nothing to protect itself from, or so we hope. And so this is why as a survivor of trauma myself and as the founder of Rewire Therapy, I've created body and somatic focused programs that work directly with the musculature and directly with the tissues to help restore circulation, to help restore oxygen, to help loosen up those constricted muscles and to work directly with those muscles instead of trying to talk through it because this is subconscious. This is a body reaction, not a talking reaction. And you'll notice when you begin to work directly with these tissues and with the body, people will feel almost afraid and say, well, I can't loosen these muscles. It feels dangerous. I feel scared to loosen these muscles. It feels dangerous to take a deep breath. And as we work like this, we notice that also very intense emotions might come up. And this is why working directly with the body addresses body memory and tissue memory. I hope that that has been informative for you and I look forward to seeing you in our next video.